Hey everybody, welcome back to Fable of the Lost Chapter 9, but game, also known as, yeah, screw it. I don't even feel like saying anything right now. Uh, see, we're back here in Oakvale, where our next quest basically picks up, so... Basically, I just cut out all that walking stuff, because it would have been another six minutes of walking, and I wouldn't have gotten nowhere. Uh, so I just decided to basically walk there off screen, and you probably could have just warped here if you really wanted to. But... I guess I was just not thinking clearly while I was walking here. Uh, many times I beat this game, you think I would know what I was doing by now. Guess not. I guess even I can be stupid sometimes. Or a lot of time. But this is where you want to go. You want to take this hole in the cave. Or this hole in, yeah, take this hole in the earth. You know, I believe it's called a cave. Uh, yeah, let's go through there. And you run into an autosave feature, like always. And our location right now is the clip top. But, but, but the clip. Cliff top pass. So yeah, this is prepare to be stealthy. Somebody get me a cardboard box. Or how about a sign that says "Is not the hero trying to get through?" Because we all know bandits are dumb. So yeah, let's continue on through here. Uh, the awareness eye on your mini map. Yeah. So look at the mini map. Is that one's closed at the moment? Now, I haven't done this in a while, so this might take me a couple tries. Okay, so I believe he comes this way and comes around. I'm not sure where he goes. And I don't think you can kill this guy either. I think you actually have to be stealthy. And I don't think I'm going to be stealthy over here. Uh, sorry, I really do not remember what I'm supposed to do to get through here. Uh, but you can watch the red dots on the screen and see where they go. One of them comes this way. I'm kind of screwed at the moment. So, yeah, I, I hear one whistling. Look at your map here. By hitting the M key on the keyboard. Clicking in the thumbstick on the Xbox, I believe. You can see where they are. Like, you got this guy like who's blocking the path right there, so I can't go down that direction. And then there's a guy at the beginning, and a guy who's spinning around over there in the corner. I think now would be a better time to start going that direction. Shit. Okay. Yeah, that was pitiful. Alright, so now we've got to actually wait for them to... That draw my blade? Dude, come on. Thank you. Did I say get out the sword? Jesus, hero. Damn it, Chicken Chaser, if you don't fucking listen. See, I hit a Q like four times over here. He's just like, nope, oh, not pulling it out. I'd rather die. Alright, so uh, that kind of tells me to be careful. And you see that hourglass? It's this time to wait. Uh... If this takes me any more, I'm probably just going to cut it out, because it's going to... This is fucking annoying. And I don't want to waste all that time, basically. So, yeah. Let's just hope that I get this right now, and not have to worry about it. It's a little bit lengthy of a quest at the moment, and if I can't get this right, then... You know... Something's wrong. Why did they run through the gate when it was opening? Alright, so... Sure, where they're going. I can see them. Like I said, I'm not sure if you can kill them or not and be stealthy about it, you know? I'm really not sure. Yeah, I think I'm about to be screwed again. Yeah. Okay. This is getting annoying. I'll see y'all in a minute when I cut this out. Alright, so we're back here now, and we're going to try again. I can't guarantee this working, and I doubt it's going to, but yeah, I'm in a new location now. Uh, like, like I said, probably isn't going to work. 
I don't remember what I used to do to get through this, what my hiding spot was. Two guards go that way. That one's just standing there looking like a dick. I know he moves. Did he move already? Don't catch me, don't catch me, don't catch me, don't catch me. And we're safe. Are my guys walking like you need to take a dump? I'll never know. But we seem to be safe now. And that's the good news. Bear, you heard what happened to Stern. What oh, happened to him? What did the idiot do this time? He only lost his bloody cap in a raid. Yeah. It was a week before he could get back into the camp. Well, then y'all yeah. leaders are dick. Get in unless you're in full gear these days. Full gear? If you ask me, old twin blades getting a bit jumpy. Oh, no Twin Boy. I feel like we've heard that name already. Hey, right, that? he was a giant of him. <laughs> yeah, and our guy looks away like, oh, who are they talking about? Could it be me? Yeah, I love the cartoonish type of nature the game has sometimes. Hey, who's that? I don't know. Turn around. Let me look. <laughs> oh, yeah. That's lovely there, hero. Fart on them when they're dead. I guess you could teabag people if you really wanted to, but I don't think it's possible in this game. I think I, I might be able to figure that out, but I do not think it's possible. Uh, as you see, we have a zero of five at the moment. Basically, we're looking for, uh, well, we'll find out in a second, actually. Now, why do you keep putting your sword away? I know you can probably punch these guys to death and all, but jeez, can I have my sword back? No. The Q button. Jeez, I'm having an issue tonight. Thank you. Okay, dude, you just die already. There, thank you. Anyway, let's try this again. Alright, so we have 05, and that's for a reason. We're on a collection hunt. Like all good games, gotta have that collection. And we're collecting... Bandit gear. Because we need bandit gear to get in. Because if you don't have it on, then you can't get into it because they won't think you're actually a bandit. Remember, guy lost his raid, his raid in a cap. In a cap. Yeah, that's, that's what happened. No, he lost his cap in a raid. He couldn't get in for a week. So, we need to get gear so that we can get in. What's up? What happened to spilling my guts out? You're right, it is all going downhill. Thank you. Alright. As you saw, we have another chest over here. Yeah, that's probably just going to be it, just this episode. <laughs> and we got a bandit shirt. Okay. So we're collecting clothes. Uh, the funny thing about this is... This. Yeah, I'm sure I, I want to sleep in it. Middle of a quest. Take a nap and regain your health. Really? I'm not complaining too much. Unfortunately, it's dark and I can't see them too clearly now. They're hard to see with the red and glow around them. But still, it's a little bit darker to see because they're in darker colors. And you can see over there, there's more guys. Oh, if you really want to. See, there's a chest over there. Ooh, I missed. I should not be a departure class. Jai! Thank you! No. <laughs> yeah. I like them apples. That can be clever sometimes too, you dick. Alright, so now we've got all those barrels over here. Break the barrels if I really want to. Aid the skill potion and some more money. And there's another chest chest over there. I kind of hit the space bar to jump. The space bar's lock on in this game. You know you've been playing too much of one game when you can't figure out what your keys are for this game. Yeah, and then we got bandit trousers in that chest. And we got three of five. And we got a little bit more ways to go. So. Alright, here's another guy to kill. Hey, kill him. There you go. Yeah. Oh, hi guys. 
Ready yourself for the, for the death of your self. Yeah. Somebody please talk for me instead. I, I can use a better narrator at the moment because what I'm saying just doesn't make any damn sense. Why aren't you attacking me? Why are you standing there like a lump on the floor? Lump on the floor. Jeez, I feel like an old person at the moment. I really wish I could see everywhere. Everything's so damn dark. It's not really that dark. It's just that my I'm playing this on a laptop, so my screen's a little down. And you know how that does for laptops. It kind of makes the screen kind of fluctuate in and out of being dark, you know? Uh, so yeah. I'm having issues seeing it with it right now. So I had to readjust my uh, laptop there for a second. We're all good now, though. Everything's okay. How are you? Anyway, there's a treasure chest over here. Uh, I'm going to open that. And we got a bandit bandana. Yeah, we're really going to look like a big dick in here in a second. Big, a big dick. There's another treasure chest. How did he shoot me turned around? Hey, you heard him. Stop being such a baby. Okay, stab him. Thank you. Alright, open up this treasure chest. It's the tab button, not the click button. And we get bandit gloves. And that should be five of five. You can see our little thing went away. Uh, let's go ahead and equip that. It looked like a dick right fast. <laughs> well, then, we want suits. And we want this one. Yeah, we look so awesome, don't we? And look, it even trims our hair up, basically. I feel like he looks stupid now. Anyway. What's up, guys? Yeah, they don't buy that you're one of them right now because you've been killing all the other ones, you know? Why we just couldn't take one of their, you know, take the clothes off of them, I'll never understand. Because then we would have had a complete set right there, you know? Maybe they have a way of telling and this is fresh equipment, maybe? Okay, shut up, Guildmaster. There's another demon door over here, but then I can see what he wants. But I don't think I have what he wants yet. Ow. I might be. You have eyesight as a rock? Well, like I said, can't do another one with him yet. For one, we don't have plate mail. I think is what I said, plate mail. Uh, but we, I believe we do have the robes he's talking about, and we do have bandit gear. So, one more to go, I guess. We can come back here and get this demon door. That should be everybody. Uh, I guess not. Let me check this treasure while I'm standing up here. So what do we got up in this chest? Resurrection pile. Uh, I'm going to refrain from saying what I normally say about, you know, what I usually say. I'm not going to say it. You know, yes, I will. This game must think we're really going to suck so much. It's giving us all these resurrection files. There. Are you happy now? All right. So anything over? No. Okay. Here we go. Twin Blades Comp. Which is a quest all in itself. Trust me. It's ridiculous sometimes. And now we've got a uh, call skate over here. Hello, mate. Nice bandit gear. Thanks, man. This here is Twin Blades Camp. Twin Blades Camp. Once you're in, you're in for good. Okay. So, feel free to get changed when you're inside. Aye, aye, Captain. Not one coming in, Joe. Open the gate. What a, what a great bandit name. Joe. Joe, open up. This new guy who's obviously in stolen armor is uh, infiltrating our camp. <laughs> Yeah, pretty much. Uh, it's my five button. Oh, okay. Well, 
That was a waste. Anyway. Uh, I believe that's it for now, guys. So, let me get changed up. Because now we can actually go back into the clothing that we like to wear, because it's not going to do anything else anyway. And we shall put this back on, because that's how I feel. <laughs> anyway. Uh, this has been Fable, The Lost Chapters. Join me next time when we continue on this hunt through Twin Blades Camp, basically, to find this blind Sirius woman. So, like I said, everybody, thanks for watching, and I'll see you all next time on Fable of the Lost Chapters. Peace out, everybody.